Hey guys, it's Tyson BBD5 here, and today uh, I just buy, uh, bought a new mic, um, a headset for my PC. So I hope the clarity is really good, better than the old one. Um, so let's get started. This video is about a cool, very cool software called K-Lite uh, K -Lite Codec Package uh, 5.0.5 and it's freeware and uh, I'll tell you what this software does it's a codec package uh, if you install the package uh, uh, you don't need any other software like VLC or um, BS player or KM player whatever uh, video players you have you don't need them to play your uh, audio and video formats uh, what this uh, codec package does is when you install it uh, it plays all your um, audio and video files in a media player called uh, the media uh, classic media player media player classic sorry um, this is the media player classic it's actually built in in windows somewhere windows xp but w this uh, using this codec uh, you can uh, play uh, almost each and every uh, file type audio and video file type so uh, this the download um, size is just 13 megabytes um, I'll give you the link in the description first of all uh, I'll show you uh, the download site here it is and when you go to the site just go to the right hand side if you want you can read the description here the whole description and then you can go to technical and see the title the file name the file size that's 13 megabytes the system requirements windows xp windows vista windows um 2000 and it's freeware license and it's added august 6 2009 you can read all that stuff if you want and um, just go to this right hand side and click on the download latest version option and hopefully when you click there it will bring out this box and just download that file and after you download the file you'll get a file like this named KL codec 500F uh, and if I go to this properties you can see in general it's an application uh, named K-Lite Codec Package Setup and it's 13.6 megabytes and and if I have an antivirus so if I scan for um, viruses it's uh, coming clean and so, so malware status is ok so no problem and just open the file and you'll uh, be presented with the setup just uh, go and clicking next and agree to whatever license terms and agreement stuff and after you install it completely uh, just <coughs> go to a sample video which you have on your PC I, ha uh, I have these many uh, videos which uh, I'll show you th the properties uh, it's a mp4 file as you can see so normally um, media player classic cannot play mp4 neither can windows media player but if now <coughs> if it doesn't open with uh, windows media player classic just right click it and go to the open with option and choose and choose uh, click on the choose pro uh, program option and you can see the list of programs and there you'll find media player classic and tick on this always use selected program uh, to kind this uh, to open this kind of um, application so when you open it you can see that the video uh, the mp4 video opens up <coughs> opens up in windows media player classic um, and I'll show you one more uh, file type that is uh, I'll go to the properties again uh, so that you don't see that hey he didn't show me this file type or something like that so if I go to the properties it's a flv dot flv file which uh, Windows Media Player cannot play by any chance so if I click on uh, if I open that file you see that it 
place this FL, FLV file so um, let's try another uh, another format so here I have a WMV format interesting um, but this is a Windows Media format anyway I'll show you that it can even play that here it is so let's try one more format the AVI format here it is AVI file format and let's play it you see that even uh, it even plays AVI format and let's try some audio format so so this is an audio file it's an mp3, MP3 file and it can obviously play it so I just have these many formats I guess um, but I am pretty sure it plays each and every um, file type so I highly recommend that you download this and if you have any VLC media player installed just uninstall it for the time being because it will ask you um, it will ask you to uninstall that before installing this sometimes uh, I had to uninstall VLC and then install it again after I installed this Klite codec package it even plays QuickTime formats and tons of other formats uh, so I highly recommend you uh, try this out I'll give you the download link in the description so don't worry um, and please check out my channel guys uh, and please comment rate and subscribe if you can and that's it thanks for watching